King Alley here. Welcome back to another YouTube video. Today is episode one of Hit or Miss Knockoff Games. Today, I was gonna play Among Us until all of a sudden I found this really cool-looking furry Among Us game that is called Suspects. So it's kind of funny to see like a furry version of Among Us, but it actually looks really cool. So if you guys want to um, see what happens next. Keep on watching. Also, according to the statistics, only a small percentage of people that watch my videos are actually subscribed. So if you're not subscribed already, hit the subscribe button. It helps me a lot. It's totally free. But really, I can't tell you what to do. So just enjoy the video. <clears throat> so we're going to be starting off just by playing. So there's special events and classic mode. So I guess I'm a beginner. So also, by the way, if you guys were wondering, like, it... I um I tried to record this before, but it didn't record my voice. So I just pray and hope this actually does record my voice. Okay, this actually looks really cool, like a house. Okay, guys. So I'm apologizing. This is Editor Allen here. I apologize, but I tried this twice, and it always meets my voice. So I'm not sure it's either the screen recorder I'm using, or it's that it's the game that's causing this. So. Right now, as one of the points of this not recording, I would give it minus one on like how this works. So if the uh, developers of this game is watching this, can you please try to fix this? I'm just asking a simple task. If you can't, yeah, well, yeah. yep, this is really weird. The tasks are a little odd, but I could see how this would like affect gameplay. It's very like, oh, like OS. So this is basically, Among Us is, is based around a huge airship. Or like a huge outer space stuff and this this looks really cool it even tells you where, where to do your tasks which is much better than among us where it's just a map a map and here you can see me getting killed by a poor little panda and look how like the um, thing looks it's really cool and ignore the noise by the way my sister's playing um Friday night so the map is based around a huge mansion which is really cool so, I'm a ghost, and in this game, when you die, you can actually talk to the other people that have died, which is really, really cool. In Among Us, you don't do that, and plus, there's no voices in Among Us. So, um, as you can see, I'm waiting for my corpse to get discovered, and this is actually really, really cool. So, while we wait for that, um, so far, how the game's looking, it's not bad, but if... If we're able to like uh, change like how my voice gets muted a lot I would make a big change which I would make better for videos but of course we, we have to like wait until that happens one day and there's me getting found out and so as like we could see right here um you can actually see a bunch of them like in this version like that separates among us is that how you can actually speak with people without like typing but like, there's still like the type button in the top right corner but when you speak in it, it's actually much more better than just typing. But this is really cool. Like, we were just discussing on who the imposter could be. And little did they know, it's Olive. Um, Ollie, sorry. I, I didn't see that. It's Ollie, the panda. So, um, just, let's just skip until, like, we win or something like that. Right here, we could see that, um, Milo gets voted out because... I don't know why, but um, in this round we lose because Fuzzy is the only one alive, meaning that he could just kill that one left. So Milo was kicked out of the game, and we lose. Of course, the killers won, and honestly, I that's funny how like this thingy shows. It's really cute. So now you're gonna see me here um, do a new round because uh, we died. And I was really hoping to be the killer, but unfortunately, I just became another guest. The reason I know that is because I'm editing the video right now. Um, I filled this last night, but it's okay. We see here playing again, and I think everyone's like back from the last round, so um, we just wait until everyone joins, and then we start. It actually is a countdown, and we wait in the lobby. We should be like probably waiting in a car or something besides the lobby, but you know this game's probably in early development. And I'm the guest, and there's a bunch of sharp objects. Okay, so I'm just gonna speed this up until something happens.
right here, someone has died, and we're here just talking about who the murderer could be. Also, I very much apologize for the people that I said to go watch this video. They wanted to. I apologize if your voices have been recorded. It's probably my screen recorder or the game itself. But we're just talking about who could be the murderer, and um, we'll just skip through it because I don't know if I can keep talking or not. Um, for some reason people just voted, um, Fuzzy, which, we'll just see if it is him or not, because I seriously don't remember. And, Fuzzy was the killer. Case closed. And, uh, this is really cute. And, weirdly and sadly, uh, an anvil fell on his head. I like the little victory dance we did, that's funny. But, as you can see, that concludes the, um... I think this concludes um, the review of the knockoff games, like my series hit or miss knockoff games. So guys, to answer your questions with the hit or miss for today's video game, Suspects. Is this game a hit or miss? Is it better than Among Us? Absolutely not. But is it as close as Among Us? Yes, it's pretty fun. So with that, this game is a hit. This game's actually really fun. I really do like this game. Oh, what's this? I got Yara. So, that's really fun. I actually do like this game. If you guys want to see my friend David play this game with me, comment, then comment down below. And this is a hit. Aw, you have to get that. Well, guys, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye!